Welcome back to the Moving at Formas Project. Really quickly, super simple. One leg squatting. What you need to know, look at this. So tripod foot, that is essentially, looking at the foot right here, boom. Look at this beautiful foot. So we got this part, that first ray. We got that heel always having contact. And then we got that fifth ray. So five, fifth ray, first ray and that heel, that's that tripod foot. So those three points have contact always. So that's the first thing that you need to know for a single leg squat. Second thing, line it up with a mirror and you can either see your waistline or your shirt line. And when you transfer it to one leg, is it the level or does it do one of these? And one of those, right? So being aware of these things. So that can tell you, all right, do I default to the outside of my legs? Are those like T-band tight, that's TFL, the pure formis? Are my, is my core not strong enough to balance my hips? Is my ass not strong enough to keep myself into hip extension? So that's why I'm always on the toes, I lose the heel. A lot of things that should be going through your head or they're going through my head when I'm looking at single leg squats. So quite simply, on one leg, everything's nice and stable, take a seat, tap your butt to the box or bench, come on up. Ideally, you're breaking parallel, but you can practice up a little bit higher, like this bench is, just to maintain that stability. So squatting down to something, I find personally it's a little bit easier than squatting down from something. So, an extra a progression, which you can do, is starting up on the bench, coming five seconds down, one, two, three, four, five. Then hop on up, one, two, three, four, five. Right, so it's eccentric, so on the way down. Next step is the concept, so the driving up part. So just simply write this. And then coming down under control, driving up again. So one cue I love to use all the time is picture just like on the radio, you're turning up that volume, you're turning up that pressure. So you're driving from one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, then you start to rise up off the ground as you're adding pressure. So eccentric is the first step. Can you control the way down? Are your hips still level? Do you have a tripod foot? Second step, concentric. Tripod foot, hips still level, core still locked, driving on up. And then for eccentric, come down under control, don't just flop down. That'll show me you have, you have an ass to control your line on the way down. Do you have a good core to control it on the way down? Lastly, the third variation of this, something you can do really easy once you master the strength part, is add some power and explosiveness to it. So you can pop up and over, or even better, on the same side, and then come down under control. Three variations, one leg. That's all you really need to know to master the single leg squat. Give it a shot tomorrow when you work out, or today when you train. Let me know what you think. Never stop moving. Moving in a performance project. See you tomorrow.